In this video, we're going to show you how to jack up a Ford F-150 the right way. Let's go. So let's start off actually a little bit further up front. Oops, almost forgot that I wasn't leveled. This is the first attempt lifting up from the motor. This is lifting it up from the front of the vehicle with the Pittsburgh jack. Both tires are off the ground. Please keep in mind, this vehicle is fully packed with tools as well. The bed as well is um, full with items. So what we're going to do is we're going to do the exact same lift. We're going to give it a little bit more stability with a piece of wood. The wood will help out because the lower you have to lift the jack, the less strength you you need. So this is a shorter slab. This is two inches thick. Yeah, two, two inches high. The two ton with the piece of wood. We see again, it's lifted off the ground. We have access to the right and left. My thoughts are the best way would be to go further back so that you would have even more leverage. One of the benefits to this, this uh, is a low profile jack, this Pittsburgh. So we're gonna go further back and see how well it lifts further back. Um, I would definitely say it is a little bit of wear on your jack if you were to use this every single day, um, but it's uh, feasible for a tire change. And then you would just get your jack stands. But let's go further back and get some even better leverage. So this here is the other area that we would like to. So I'm right behind the front rim. So you just place this back here. This is the sweet spot here, right along this right here. As you see, it's off the ground and it doesn't require much strength. This is the best right here. At the beginning, it will be a little hard because you have to get past this, this here. So you could do this all day and it would not impact your jack. So here we have another section here. This is basically for the front end. You're actually right in line with the steering wheel. Let's go lift. If you did have another 4x4 that went in the opposite angle, as you noticed, we had to avoid this pipe here. So that's why we had to turn it parallel to the bar. But if you had a smaller piece of wood, it would probably give you a little better leverage. So these are the three sections. This is the, the best right here. Um, if you want to, if you can only access it from the side, if you can't access it from the front, this would be the best here. And um, maybe you can't, maybe you're parked in front of a garage, but you would have side access here. Now, as regards to this location, only use this location if it's your last result. Once again, this is a Pittsburgh Jack, and um, this, definitely, this three-ton Jack would easily be able to lift up this F-150 Ford F-150 XLT. And to see how this lifts up the back of the truck, you can see this video right here. It appears that this is a four-wheel drive, so we can see the connection for the four-wheel. And here we have it, so thank you for uh, checking all of this information out and if you have any questions leave them below as regards to the links to this actual uh, jack they will be listed below actually pedro would you like to let us know where they will be listed thank you pedro de san pedro de marcuris